Hi, I'm Alex with PEX Universe, and today I'm going to go over the most popular ways you can secure your copper pipe or PEX tubing with various hangers and devices. Each of these devices I'm going to show you has a different makeup for its own use cases. This is the Clevis hanger, and it's used to support horizontal pipe runs, most commonly near the ceiling. These are used in combination with threaded rod and beam clamps or ceiling plates. Various options are available for copper, black iron, or cast iron for PVC pipes. These also allow for lateral movement and some degree of adjustment. So these are the number one choice for supporting pipes where sloping the pipes is uh, an important factor. A clevis hanger requires a proper length threaded rod and a means to attach it to a ceiling or beam like in this picture. Riser clamps are designed to support vertical pipe runs where it penetrates a floor. So each clamp includes two brackets, two blots, and two nuts and various options are available for copper, black, cast iron, and PVC pipes. Once secured over the pipe, wide flanges of the clamp distribute the load to the flooring around the opening and prevent the pipe from sliding down. Strut clamps are used to secure vertical or horizontal pipe runs to standard strut channel. Each clamp includes two brackets, one bolt, and one nut. These are also called Kindorf clamps because they're used in combination with strut and Kindorf. Use cushioned clamps for copper pipe and standard clamps for all other types. Top beam clamps are designed for attaching hanger rods to the top flange of a beam or bar joist where the flange thickness does not exceed three quarters of an inch. And these beam clamps are very similar, but the open U design permits rod adjustment. Split ring hangers support vertical or horizontal pipe runs. They use in combination with threaded rod and accessories to be attached to the wall, ceiling, or beam. These come in sizes from 3 8 of an inch to 4 inches and in copper, plain, or electro galvanized. Metal pipe straps will attach the pipe flush to the mounting surface so that there's zero clearance. And all you need for these is some screws right here and then the pipe will be nice and secure. Plastic pipe straps offset the pipe about 1 8 of an inch to one quarter of an inch from the surface depending on the size and both are secured using screws. Steel C clamps are designed for attaching a hanger rod to the bottom of a flange of an I-beam and the hanger rod should make contact with the beam to ensure full engagement. These are made of low carbon steel and can hold a max load of 400 pounds. They come in plain or galvanized steel. J-hooks are used to suspend horizontal runs of DWV and Schedule 40 PVC from wooden beams and each of these comes with two nails so you can take them off and nail them through any of these holes to secure the J-hook. These are a great choice for buildings with wooden beams and since they are made from plastic they do not corrode in human environments. You can find alternative uses for these like securing bulky wire runs. Hanger straps are also known as band iron are very straightforward and they are perforated flexible metal strips which can support pipe where it is running parallel with a wooden beam just like you see in this picture. Side beam connectors are designed for attaching rods to the side of wooden beams of walls. It secures a standard threaded rod, either half inch or three eighths of an inch to the side of a wooden or metal beam. Ceiling flanges are designed to provide means for attaching a hanger rod to wooden beams or ceilings. And the maximum recommended load for this model of flange is 180 pounds. But it varies as you get larger ones. The adjustable swivel ring hanger is designed for the suspension of non-insulated stationary pipelines. The knurled insert nut allows a vertical adjustment after installation. You can get these from half inch pipe all the way up to 8 inches, which can hold around 300 to 1000 pounds respectively. Tube talons are small plastic clamps with a built-in nail that allow you to secure PEX or copper on vertical and horizontal runs. So all you do is place down the PEX and you put it in the talon and then you hammer in the nail and then it's secured. If you look in the description you can find the explanation for the differences between galvanized, black iron, and epoxy finishes for all of these hangers and devices. So check that out if you're interested. And if you found the video helpful press like and always subscribe to the channel if you like the videos that you see.